Let's check out the Kiki bag from Latico. Everyone, hope you're having an awesome day today. I have this new package from Latico to open and check out with you. Um, I recently saw this brand on Instagram, and it looks like they make really cool, unique leather handbags. They're a family-run brand based out of New Jersey. Oh, this is so cute. Look, it says crafted with love. Nice packaging. It comes in a dust bag and also a plastic bag, so it's nice and protected. Their bags are genuine leather, and this one, really caught my eye oh my gosh i love the color already it's a really pretty blue color i can't remember if it's called denim let me see if it says here on the tag yes it's called denim oh my gosh look at this okay i love the detail of the front i love the denim color the leather feels really nice and soft Okay, so what drew me to this bag in particular was I love the hobo style. I love the detail of how this leather is sewn here. And my favorite part about it was there was a hidden pocket right here. You see that magnet? Hidden magnet. And I believe my phone can fit. Yes, and still snap closed. It can fit both ways. The pocket goes all the way down to here. So you have plenty of room there for your phone or whatever else you want to put there. Oh, I love this. There's also a zippered pocket here on the back. So you could put in like your wallet or something back here and have quick access to your phone and your wallet on the outside. Um, it looks like the drop length on the bag is going to be perfect for over the shoulder. Oh my gosh. Okay, I can't get over this color. I knew online that I loved the pictures. I was hoping in person that I would like it as much as I did online um, because it's not just like your everyday kind of like dark blue. It has some different like color variations in the leather. Uh, it's so, so pretty. I hope you guys can see that. You can see the different um, color variations there. Let me show you on the back what it looks like um, on just the plain leather pieces. It is so soft and squishy. I love it. Okay, let me check out the inside. Um, I also like that this bag has a zipper closure, so it's nice and secure. Let me see here. Ooh, really nice smooth zipper, and there is a little bit of a tail, which is great because then the bag will open up a little bit wider for you. So opening this up, you have, um, let me pull out the packaging. Oh, there's actually more going on in the inside than I thought there would be. So you have two slip pockets on this side. I like that they're trimmed out in this leather. It makes it easy to see those pockets. This one is a little bit um, smaller. This one's a little bit of a wider pocket. And then on this side, this is super cool. Um, you have a zippered pocket and then they have the logo here. And then right here, there actually is a place for you to put some cards. You could put your wallet stuff right here and then a place for like pens, um, maybe some lip gloss or something could fit in there. I have to test it out. And then the rest of the interior is a um, black color and just like a nice open space. Just from first impressions, I think this bag is super cool. I love the design again, it's so cool. And I think it's gonna be just like a really easy, comfortable bag. Let me quickly pack this up and see what I can fit. And then I'll show you what I have packed inside. All right, you guys, I have it all packed up. I love the way it packs up. Um, look at the beautiful slouch in the leather of the bag. It's gorgeous. Um, the bottom has this kind of oval base to it. Really like how the handles here have a flat handle instead of being like completely rolled. So it's really nice and comfortable to wear on your shoulder. Probably my favorite feature is how these leather pieces are stitched here on the front. It's so unique. And then you have the hidden magnetic pocket. So in here is where I have put my phone. I can put it this way or this way, no problem. This pocket goes all the way to the bottom. Okay, now getting into the main portion of the bag. Again, love the zippered pocket, love that it has the tail so it opens up nice and wide here. I'm gonna show you packed a couple of ways because I do have a baby, so I have to carry a few more things that if you were just carrying this as a regular purse, you wouldn't need to have with you, but I love that it's big enough that I can fit these things if I wanted to. So I'm utilizing a couple of packing pouches here. First thing I've got is some diapers and wipes. So one for my toddler and a few for my newborn. And I have some little um, baggies here for dirty diapers, but that's all the diapering stuff is in one pouch. 
And then in this middle pouch, I'm keeping some toiletry stuff. Some of it's for me, some of it's for baby, but I'm really excited that this um, pouch does fit into this bag. And as you can see, it has this nice clear front, so I'm able to like see what I need and grab for it quickly. And then in the last pouch here, um, I've just thrown in a change of clothes for the baby, some hair bows, and an extra pacifier. Now, let me show you quickly. Everything else is really just for me. If I was packing this for myself, I probably still need some sort of toiletry bag. So I'm gonna keep that inside of here. I have my planner. And then also check this out. This is my 13 inch laptop and that fits in there horizontally with no problem. I can still um, zip up the bag with no issues. Let me show you what that looks like. So my laptop is in there. You still have beautiful slouch in the bag. So I was very excited to see that um, all of that could fit. Let's take a look at this front wall of the bag on the inside. Um, in this smaller pocket, I have thrown in a hand sanitizer spray. And then over here, I have a package of wet ones, which I was really excited that this actually went down really far. So these pockets are pretty um, deep, which is great. So package of wet ones in there. And also um, I do have a boogie board in there for my daughter. And then the other side, um, I have thrown in a cuticle serum inside of one of those loops, also a tied to go pen. And then in the zippered pocket, I have a cliff bar and a um, chomps like beef stick. And then I also have in there, this is a really deep pocket, um, my earbuds, some different lip products are in there. And then my keys are just tucked down towards the bottom of that pocket. But like I said, nice and deep. I think it goes, yeah, it goes all the way down to the base of the bag. So that's awesome. I love that all these extras are trimmed out in this beautiful, um, genuine leather material, especially in this blue color. It just really pops against the black so you can see it very nice and easily. Um, I did throw in my wallet into this back pocket. Uh, but I love that they have this wallet feature for you just in case you just want to be a little minimal and just throw your cards into um, the back here. It keeps everything nice and simple and secure um, in the back of the bag here. So that is the beautiful Kiki style bag from Latico. Um, I love it. I can't say enough good things about it, especially this denim color. If you don't like this particular um, style of bag, at least go check out their website and see if there is another bag that you might like in this beautiful denim color. It's so gorgeous in person. Like I said, the leather itself feels really nice and soft. I love all the variations in the color and the texture feels really nice. It has a little bit of pebbling to it, but not too much. And like I said, really buttery, soft bag. If you have any questions about this style, let me know down in the comments below. Also, if you're interested in seeing any other bag style reviews from Latico, please let me know. Um, I'm interested in grabbing a few more styles from them because I love this bag so much. So please give me your ideas down in the comments. There's a really pretty like sling bag. I think it's called the Cali. So I think I want to try that next and I'll be sure to grab that bag for you and possibly some others if you guys are interested in seeing those. As always, I'll be sure to link this down below so you can easily find it. But thank you so much for joining me for this bag review today and I will see you guys very soon for my next one.